gang, Power Bricks back with another LEGO Megas review. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Sedesu C Skywell. This is the seventh Rangers Mecha, which is controlled by the Green Ranger. Again, there's the Lime Ranger, which I should have said in the first review, but it's the Lime Ranger, and here's the Green Ranger Zord. We have the Sky Whale, Sky Crab, Sky Shark, Sky Saw Shark, and Sky Penguin. Now let's jump into this. Getting a look at Sky Whale, he looks fantastic, like a giant whale carrier. Um, I really do enjoy this guy all around. The aesthetic of him is just perfect. He came out excellent for me, and I couldn't be more happier on how he turned out. Um, mainly he's a giant green whale. There's actually more to him than meets the eye. Um, let's jump into that now. For starters, we have the rotating propeller. Up there that's kind of shaky but it does rotate um, then you got these on the side and if you come up you can just get a look at his face there you open up his mouth oops wasn't supposed to come out um, let me try to get that effect back in there just lift it up there we go and there are some guns under his tongue so I thought that would be a pretty nice touch. They just fold up and his mouth closes right back up. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it for the whale. He's the smaller one out of the rest, I can tell you right now. And he's not all the way compatible with the rest of the other smaller zords. He can't compat. He's not compatible with them, only from his legs, not his arms. And you'll see why in a second. Next up is the Sky Shark. And here he is. Um... The Sky Saw Shark is very plain purple. Um, there's not much he can really do besides just be a shark. So let's jump into what he can do right now. It's kind of simple. Just move his head up and down, 360 rotation. Now it can open all the way like that and close. Um, these can move, and that's his jet mode if you just put those backwards. Those work as thrusters and turn them out. They're just like that. So that's just about it for that. Next is Penguin. And Penguin is, well, a Penguin. That's all I can say. Uh, there's not really too much he can do either. So let's just get into it. He does look nice though. So articulation, you just get the flapping wings and the head can move. And I put him in jet mode, put it down and open those up. And there is his jet mode. All completed in Jetty. Let's go to the next. Now what I was saying about how he's not compatible with the other limbs, this is one of the limbs that he's compatible with. There's only two arm limbs that he can take and it's this one and the crab. And simply because they're smaller and his arms won't pick up that much weight from the others. But here is Sky Shark and it's pretty simple. And this is a Junior Sedesu Mech. Um, the head can move up and down, that's about it, all around. Ball joint, um, the Sedesu Ryu is flat rather than a thick, bulky one. And that's pretty much it for the Sky Shark. Next is Sky Crab, which is my favorite. And he is my first crab build, and I think he would not be my last. Now, simply because he's a red crab, let's get into what this junior mech can do. Now, all he can do is have his claws articulated. Move all the way around, like so. In and out, like that. And that's about it. Um, the Sedesa disc can come off, which is cool and all. But that's about it for him. Um, jet mode is simple too, almost forgot about that. You just fold that out, and there is his jet mode. Getting this guy merged up is quite easy. Now, for starters, we're just going to take off this piece back here, bring these up, and extend them, the propellers, all the way out. Take off this big propeller and bring it up. To the chest you can stand it up there and then plug this on top lift up that fin and there is your torso 
the legs are super simple. Now, first with Penguin, I have it in jet mode, so you're just gonna flip that up and bring these back, and there's a leg. With Shark, you put those up, stick that up, and those are your two legs. And getting these guys into the arms are very simple. You just get the crab and bring these all the way down to when they look like this, and this just stays like, <laughs> you just turn it, and there are your arms. Now, here's the merging sequence. So first, I'm going to, that's not supposed to be there. Um, we're just gonna plug these in to there, if I can get it lined up. There we go. Plug those into there, and there is your legs. There are your legs. Um, then you get crab, plug him onto the side, along with the shark. And here he is all merged up. He looks fantastic. This guy is awesome. Um, he's really flat though, I will tell you that. But then again, that's pretty much this whole thing is based on based upon blocks and circles. Um yeah, that's just about it for this guy. Um articulation, let's jump into that now. We only get a 360 arm rotation and that's about it the legs are interchangeable but i won't be going into that because you guys know what that is if you've seen my past reviews if you haven't go check them out now that is the sedesu deno and the lion i forgot what i called it the lion the black lion one <laughs> you'll see it can't miss it okay so yeah that's it for this review and this is power Brick signing off